Chris Cowan here with our Lincoln Elementary Board update. Um, we have a great start to the beginning of the year. A uh, little update from our jump start. We had 66 students daily and 70 students that attended that overall. And it was great to see everybody back in the building and getting started. We have been collecting new data and entering discipline data in a different way in our power school and Jordan Mooney at the district office helped us with that. Uh, we're going to be able to identify different times of days that students are struggling to be able to target better interventions for them. So pretty excited about that. Uh, we had our open house. We saw just about every family in our door. Um, so many smiling faces and new students and uh, good to meet our new second graders. We had our Flint Hills music display to start off band this year. We have 31 band members signed up to participate in band. Um, our fifth graders are the only ones that are offered band here at Lincoln. That's kind of our beginner class. Uh, we had our HEPA back to school bash. Thank you to everybody that helped with that. They helped raise some funds for our parent organization. I had some carnival games. I heard it was a lot of fun. There was even a dunk tank. Um, our fourth graders went to Ag Day. Um, we had great weather that day. Uh, the students really enjoyed the activities and the hay rack rides. Um, special thanks to Mr. Crowd as he went and served our students pizza and uh, got to participate. Um, the Barton Community College basketball team has been coming to Lincoln to eat lunch with our students. Um, there's a video of it on our Facebook page if you haven't checked it out. It's a pretty awesome video. Um, I'm not for sure who had more fun, the students or the basketball players, but it, it was fun. Um, our fifth grade had the opportunity to go to the state fair um, and uh, got to see all kinds of different things. We even got to see one of our students do some activities with the horse. Uh, our second grade graders are going to our Wetlands Day coming up. Uh, they get to participate in different activities with local second graders from different schools. Um, I got to go last year to some great activities um, about life cycle, about caring for nature, um, hands-on fun stuff. We've been having different therapy dogs visit our school. Um, Luna's here only one day a week and then she goes to the middle school one day a week. Um, so to fill in, we have Henry with Mrs. Nicholson training in the building and Ace with Mrs. Haxton training in the building. Uh, it's been fun to have them around. They alternate days uh, and give lots of puppy snuggles. Uh, our HEPA meeting, which is our parent organization, got rescheduled to October 16th and that will be held at 6.30 here at Lincoln. Uh, so hope to see a lot of you there. Uh, we had our family fall fun night on September 19th. Uh, we had a Rockwell competition, snacks, math games and activities, and some parent support and resources. We had 196 in attendance, so thank you to everybody that came out and uh, participated in that. Uh, on the 20th, we also had our body venture. For those of you that don't know what the body venture it is, it's a giant inflatable, um, and the students walk through the human body. Uh, they pretend like they're a piece of food, and they go through um, healthy eating habits and digestion in different parts of the body. Um, it was really neat to see. Um, it's updated this year. So uh, thank you to all the volunteers that came out to help us make that happen. Uh, we also have our Clara Barton Medical Center Vaccine Day coming up on October 4th. It's great to partner with them and uh, make it easy for our students and staff to get vaccines. They come right to us here at the school and we have a lot that participate. Uh, we're looking forward to some other great months and uh, look forward to talking to you all soon.